The next thing you want to do is to take the files you have that are in those folders and import them into the library. This way, machine will see them all the time. They'll say, okay, you open machine up. We're looking for all the sounds that belong to the library. Okay, we got it. It's ready for you whenever you need it. So for example, I go to here and I'm right clicking. I can't add to favorites. I can't import to library because this is a separate sound, a separate file. Let's go back up one level here. I go back up one level and now I'm at the folder. I right click here and now I can add it to favorites. I can also import to the library. Now, if I go to import to library, I have the ability now to tell machine what I want to categorize it as a type. You know, and I got everything here. Look at this. I've got everything I need right here. I can say loops and there's loops. Okay. I'll say it's loops. Oh, we got more stuff. These are just drum loops. Oh, I like that. And then hip hop. That's right. These are hip hop drum loops. So look, and if I think it's something different, I can always add, as you can see at the bottom of each one of these columns is a plus sign. So I can say, for example, I can say, well, these are loops. These are certain type of loops. I can make a different idea. Go here. I say, well, uh, here I can say these not just drum loops. These are drum machine loops, right? Let's go to here. I'll say drum machine loops. All right. Let's make that. Wait, I and E. And since we're in loops, I know it's loop. I'll say drum machine. A new category called drum machine. It's also drum loops, but drum machine loops. Peep that out. I can pull this out of here. Of course, I got back to here. I've got hip hop beats, right? I can come to here. Once I get there, nothing's here in the type. I can add a new type there as well. And this is to get you familiar with and make it easier for you to categorize, set types up for the samples or the sounds you want to import into your machine library. Now, once that's done, I'll say, OK, I'll come to the bottom here, select OK. And look what happens. It's importing the folders into the library. It's going to say, I'm tagging this, I'm tagging this one. And whenever you want it, they're always there. So I can go back to here in the library. I can go right here I'm at, right? And we got loops. I can say we got samples right there. We got loops. Oops, there they go. We got some loops. And the loops are right there. Let's turn this up a little bit. We can hear it better. Oh, yeah. You got it right there. And it's right there. I'm just tapping. I can hear my loops over and over. And they're already tagged. This is a great way for you to import your samples and your sounds into machine.